How's it going everyone? This is Ash and this is Tiny Rogues Between Heaven and Hell. So from what I understand, Heaven and Hell is a recent update to the game uh, that made it pretty awesome. That's what I read in the comments. So let's check it out. Yes, I have a game save. I played a little bit. I was just kind of testing the game out to see how I feel about it. An hour long? My goodness. Must be a good game, right? It is. It's a really good game. <laughs> so let's start a new save in slot two. So this is us. We are this individual right now. Just kind of a standard base character. Uh, right here, we can level up our character, do passive level ups. But this is a bullet hell kind of game, so we need to go in there first and survive. So we're going to choose our class. The hero. A hot-blooded young hero on a quest to vanquish humanity's biggest adversary. Can they defeat death? I hope so. That's who we're choosing. We're, we're, we're this character. Let's go. Game saved. We are here, in the pit. Um, okay, they're not gonna give me the tutorial, because they know I've played it, that's cool. So we're gonna go, I guess it automatically gave me a mage. So let's go with bombs. I don't really need a sword, I mean, I could have got a sword, I guess, a strength. But strength isn't really gonna benefit me unless I choose a different class, which right now I'm mage, I'm cool with that. So let's go with intelligence. Seems to make sense, right? Get your mana high, get your intelligence high, and get a lot of cool mage gear. So far, my favorite in this game is the rogue build, like the archer. Um, I'm gonna go with... Dexterity is tempting, but I don't really need it. Oh wait, I do. I have all the weapons. I have a sword and I have a bow also. Okay, cool. So let's go get dexterity. So this game might seem similar to a certain it's kind to me it's kind of like a mix between Binding of Isaac and like Vampire Survivors. It's a mix between those kind of games, which is really cool. Uh, not locked. Well, I want the key. I'm gonna go get the key. Because you never know when you need a key. Makes sense. Let's pick up the key. So we have cursed gold. I try to avoid cursed. Like, that's just me right now. I, I try to avoid anything cursed. Doesn't seem good, right? I'm gonna go with more intelligence. Because, you know, I'm, I'm gonna go read some books and stuff. And... Harry Potter stuff. It's fine. I'm a mage. That's what we do. We study Harry Potter novels. Uh, so dice lets you re-roll um, if you have a like bad item. Like let's say I open a chest and all the items are pretty poopy. I can re-roll it. But I'm going to go ahead and get gold. Because I have none. And I feel like I want a little bit of that. So this game is a little bit brutal with the damage. So I already got hit, as you can see. Um, and that isn't good. Let's go with some more dexterity, I guess. Please don't hit me, please don't hit me. I'm a mage for now, but you never know. I might want to pull out that bow at some point. So I'm gonna try to I love up both. I'm gonna go to this random event over here. It's a grave with flowers. A to interact. Okay. Here rest a once powerful hero. They fought valiantly to protect the innocent. Hearing about the hero's legacy fills you with determination. Really? I got filled with determination? Okay, Undertale. Alright, so we have a guaranteed rare item or a guaranteed charm. I kind of want the rare item. I want to see what it will give me. The charms are cool too. So to get the rare item, I have to fight the Spider Queen. Time to feast. I'm a Spider Queen. I got to talk like that. 
That's not how a spider talks, but you know what? I could be whatever kind of spider I want to be. No one told me how to be a spider. Oh, spider jumped. Gotta watch out for that landing. So this... The boss fights in this game are awesome. Hiss! I'm going to feed you to my children. I bet you're gonna try. So this is phase two. It gets a little crazy. She tries to web me. With multiple webs. And if you get webbed, well, you get stuck. You don't want to get stuck. Ow. Oh, I, I got hit by two hearts. I still have... I can regenerate two hearts. Okay, I have a vial to... Do you see the red vial? That gives me one heart regeneration. So I'm going to go ahead and use that. There we go. Magnet ring. So a magnet ring is... Mana star pickups are immediately pulled towards you. Cool. Flower pot. Periodically launch three fireball mortars <laughs> near enemies. It's a helmet. It's a flower helmet. That's awesome. And it just launches flower fireballs. Or I can get a balloon bundle. Grants 30% increase with movement speed. Pops a balloon when taking damage. Oh my gosh. It's Mario Kart, huh? I'm taking the flower pot, which is uh, plants versus zombies, I think. I don't know. It seems to have some kind of reference. So let me go to my menu here. I hit the wrong button. So my flower pot's already doing its job. It's shooting everywhere. Yeah, auto-equipped. Look at this. Look at these fireballs. That's awesome. All right, next floor. Got a little random fireball shooting everywhere. That's pretty cool. Hopefully I don't hit any innocents. Take a seat. Um, I'm not sure if I want to waste money on you for one heart. Things are not going to get easier. I know. I'm not going to go cursed. I'm going to get the chest. What I really need, though, it, something I like to try to get as early as possible, is a better weapon. Chest gave me a key. Thanks. <laughs> Just imagine opening a chest and getting a key to a chest. Doesn't that seem a little funny? Um, armory contains uncommon weapons. I'll take that. I, I want a different weapon. What the heck? This sword's covered in blood. Executioner's sword. Um, attacks per second, 1.56. Weapon range is far. So it's a sword. I'm kind of a mage build right now. Okay. Then we have a mana scepter. Uh, okay, 50% of mana drained by this weapon is refunded. That's nice. And then a sniper bow. I'm going to take the mana scepter, but the sword seems really cool. Happy. It's a happy weapon. Nice. I'm going to take this one. I'm a mage. I do mage things. Well, I might as well stick with mage. It, it gave me mage. Alright. Whoa! No way! That's freaking awesome! So I have a beam of light now. Okay, so let's go with beef. Is the other one? I didn't want to waste a bomb. Well, use a bomb. It's not really a waste. Oh, I got hit, but you know what? It's all right. Woohoo! Level up. So I can do rogues reliability. Periodically mark the enemy with the lowest health. No thanks. So these are both are kind of rogue up top. You can tell because they're green. Uh, range attacks gain plus 100%. That's great if I was a range person. So I also have poison aura for mage. Grant you an aura that inflicts poison. We're taking that. We're automatically taking that. Look at that. I got a poison aura and I have fireballs. That's pretty awesome. All right, let's go get this random potion. So basically, if someone gets in close range of me, my mage character right now, they get a lot of damage. Get hurt pretty bad. So we got a rainbow potion. What it does, I don't know. A wooden chest. We'll go take that. 
The green blossom gives me a stamina surge. Okay. There's a shop. Buy items in shops. Uh, let me use my... Looks like this came back. I'm going to use it. Gives me another heart. And... I'm going to go ahead... I'm going to go to the resin. I don't like spending money this early on. I don't think there's anything really worth me spending money on. Not yet. Fairy Pine. Grant's Fairy Pine resin on consumption. Okay. I'll, I'll take it. Sure. I might as well just eat it now. I don't know what it does. Thanks. Um, I want... I want the intelligence. So I'm gonna go that route. I had to use a bomb, yes. But I'll, I'll get more bombs. It's okay. Don't worry, bombs. This this is a... There's a lot of bullets you have to dodge on screen. So I, if I don't talk for a while, it's probably because it's just a lot going on. In some of those instances. So grants two to three random consumables. I don't really want consumables. I'll take a resin. All right. If I can level up this little beam I have, that would be cool. Gold pine resin again. So I can get a cursed charm or I can get a guaranteed accessory. Obviously we're going accessory. Who dares enter my lair? So we have the lich. One of these days I'm gonna take the cursed one. I seem to always get the lich. Okay, phase two, I got one health. We'll see what happens. I might have underestimated you a little bit. Good for you. Well, thanks, Lich. Such positivity. Ah, dang it. No, well, maybe you overestimated me, Lich. You gave me such compliments, and I died. Well, we unlocked more characters. Objective complete. Brave the unknown. Your world tier is now one. Achieving this world objective enables a new set of enemies to appear on each floor. Thanks. Okay, so we got one crown into our mastery. We now have ranger. We have sorcerer. And we have Knight. So I like Knight. Knight is awesome. At least I think so. In the 11th hour, healing rewards are 50% more common while at the brink of death. Oh yeah. I have a feeling we're going to need that. You start with one soul heart? Oh, no, no, no. That's better. That's better. Let me refund this one. I want a soul heart. Okay, we're good with that. I'm gonna take night. And then I'm gonna go back in. So the question mark is uh, kind of... Here, I'll, I'll go to the question mark. Question marks are the objectives. So now it says the bonfire calls upon you to vanquish death and expand. So I need to defeat death. Up here shows different kind of unlocks, different class unlocks. So right now we just have these classes. Alright. We're going with Knight. I like Knights because you get a dodge. You get two shields. Now I have the soul heart and I have three hearts. It's a lot of stuff. Knight can hold pretty well. Hold up pretty well. I'm going to get a key. I was having fun playing Knights. In my little testing experiment. I didn't get very far, by the way. Just just letting you know. So let's go ahead and get some strength. I'm a knight, after all. I like to get strength. And armor. And knight stuff. Which is strength and armor. <laughs> right? Vitality, I guess. So, yeah, I like I like having all the uh, ability to take hits and not have to worry too much about that. Um, Grant's 
five souls. Oh, that's cool. But I'm gonna go to the events. It's this thing again. Here rests the once powerful hero. They fought valiantly to protect the innocent. I got determination. Got me some more determination. All right, gold. I'm a knight. I don't need no intelligence. Or maybe I do. I don't know. So knights can use like pretty much any weapon. It just depends how you want to build the knight up. Uh, let's go over here. Grab some more bombs. Might need them eventually. Get me some armor soon too. That'd be good. That's that's pretty much my ability is armor. I need as much as that of that as I can. Be as strong as possible. Um, I'm gonna go shattered. I have enough bombs to shatter it. Okay, drop a bomb there. Boom, I got two keys. Two keys for one bomb. That seems like a good exchange. Guaranteed boots. Let's go get some boots. It's a spider again. I'm gonna get the other battles victory. I think the other one's a minotaur. But I didn't want a cursed item, so I'm not going Minotaur yet. Come on. I'm going to feed you to my children. No, you're not. You're going to be a squashed spider. Look at your health is already so low, man. What happened? I thought you were a big spider. Big spider. Gary Spider Queen. Oh, it took away my purple thing. That's fine. It's a dodge. I don't mind. What do we get? What do we get? Well, there are boots. You did guarantee me boots. <laughs> socks with sandals? Do I look like I would wear socks with sandals? I am a mighty knight. On combat, start intimidate all enemies in the room. That sounds awesome. We also have Fletcher Charm, which is a range 10% increase. Or Drake Charm, which... Wait, what? Grants 25% increased damage dealt to dragons. I'm going to fight dragons? Okay, I'm going to take the socks with sandals because, you know, sounds funny. Auto equip, good. Let's continue. Doo, 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 doo. We're in the boneyard. The boneyard. Uh, let's go get some strength. My socks with sandals immediately intimidated them. That's awesome. Okay, so I wasn't. I was wrong about the uh, dodge or evade. It's actually a block. So I blocked that blast. But the good thing about the block is it regenerates. I don't know if it's every room or every few rooms. Might be a time thing, but it regenerates. That's a very handy thing. Set item stash. Ooh, let's go that way. Get me a set item piece. Ow, I took a hit of armor there. That's not good. What do we get? Thief hood? That is the most useless thing to my character. Uh, two set equals lock picking. It allows you to attempt picking locks even if you don't have the keys. I'll take it. It doesn't make sense for me, but I'll take it. Yeah, I'm keeping my helmet. It gives me armor plus one. I will take the... I'm going to go the armor. There's a weapon route. Definitely going weapon route. So I can get a burning reinforced club plus three. Dang. That's a lot of damage. 227 to 446. The tomahawk plus one. It's an axe melee. Or a battle axe. Dude, we're going to get the burning club. Come on. It's awesome. It's a burning club. 
What more could you want from a club? Besides to be burning in club. It's a very blocky attack. It'll do though, it'll do. At least it's got some range to it. It's probably not gonna be my go-to cursed warrior stash, huh? I don't know about a curse. Curses seem so dangerous. And then there's also golden chest. We're going gold. I'm sticking with my no curse playthrough. Curses might be good for like maybe a cleric or something. That can probably undo the curse. Triangle. Instrument. Primary attack. Primary attack deals. This. Okay, well that's great. That's great. I'll put that in my inventory. I'm gonna go to the tavern because there's an achievement for going to the tavern. Do 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 do. Hey, what's up? What's up? What's up? Welcome tavern. You look very healthy. I don't think I could help you. You don't know me. This person's dancing very well. I need your strongest potions. My potions are too strong for you. But I am giving it going to battle. I need your potions. Yeah, yeah brother. Here's an arm. Do you sell me armor? I am a knight of the order of the silver flying dragon. Show me your weapon, traveler. Yikes, not the best weapon. You should really try to find something better. I doubt you'll be making it very far. You have a little faith. I was hoping you would sell me armor. How about you? What do you sell? Hello there, tavern bruise is good, but I make my own. You know what? I'll sell you some. You want to buy some sake? I'm cool. I don't want to use money for sake. I want to use money for armor. Can I help you? No. I'm beyond your assistance. How about you, Mr. Mage? Oh, you sell bo bottle stuff. All right, well, that was fun. Let's go to the shop. What do you sell? Demolition helmet. Equipment load gets lower. Increases explosion damage. I don't think I have that. Laser gun. What? That sounds awesome. But I'm not a mage. Uh, dragon cell. Wow, whoa, whoa. There we go. On dash, gain combat paress. That's pretty cool. Kind of like my intimidation sock shoes, though. Banjo. Well, thank you for talking to me. But I don't need anything from your store. Thank you, thank you. Boop, 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 boop. When is my uh, shield block gonna come back? Right, I'm gonna drop something there. What's this? Power shard? Grants one experience. That's awesome. I'm gonna take the set because I'm not a magic user. Oh. I am so cold and lonely. Embrace me. I always fight you. I need to get the other person sometime. I guess the other person's more like, go there if you're a mage. You're on fire, dude. I set you on fire, dude. That, you try to hit me with a little ball thing? Come on. He's ice, and I use fire, so it's perfect. Don't be afraid of death, touch. Death is so kind to us all. You don't know death. <laughs> That's probably not a bad thing. Ow. You hurt my armor. It hurt my armor again. Oh no, I'm losing focus. Ah! 
Oh, I got one heart damage. Second boss defeated. What do we got? We got a green thing. Leprechaun. <laughs> Leprechaun frock. Grants a 50% increased chance of luck taking effect. Two set equals... The, if I get both pieces of the set, I get end of the rainbow. Right. Uh, clockwork boots. Periodically trigger your dash on effect. Uh, or a shield. A shield might be nice. Gives me one more block damage. Do I have a shield? I do. I already have a shield. Thank you. I'm going to take the leprechaun thing because they have no armor. And it's funny. Alright, time to continue. The jungle. Uh, favor for souls. Yes. I need... I need to fully recover my health. I don't have a lot of health, actually. Do you just recover hearts? I don't need you after all. If you recovered armor, that's a different story. Okay, we're gonna go bumps. Ooh, that was a lot of damage. My fire attacks are doing great. I mean, it's a plant level, so it makes sense, right? Fire, plant. <laughs> good damage, good damage. There we go. If only it was a long range. Uh, let's go set item. Maybe we can get the other piece of our leprechaun here. Find a rainbow. Come on, carrots. Speeding gullet. There we go. What do we got here? Thief gloves. I, I like have a whole set of thief gear now. That's great. Thanks. Uh, let's go golden chest. Let's try her. You know what? No, I'm going. I'm going for the strength increase. The chests are not working out for me right now. I keep getting the wrong stuff. Do, 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 do. Oh, they get faster. These centipede creatures get faster. Seems like everything's getting stronger. Okay, okay. I have one carrot thing. There we go. Pawn shop. Let's go to the pawn shop. I need to sell some. Oh, but there's another set item. All right, we're going to set item because that's leprechaun. We have to get our full leprechaun. We have to. I want at least one full set. It'd be nice if these things become like permanently unlocked. So I could just use the thief gear whenever. What's this? Maid, <laughs> Maid costume. Parodically charms all enemies in the room every eight seconds two set equals perfect service charming an enemy also inflicts vulnerability so the other piece of this gear is cat ears right you know we gotta wear that let's see But the luck from the leprechaun thing is what got us the beautiful maid gear. Okay, that's fine. Oh, we look so good in the maid outfit. Heck yeah. All right, I'm gonna go get my random potion. Parodically charms enemies. Heck yeah. Who wants to be my minion? It's actually a pretty nice little, little setup. If only I had cat ears. 
Got my health potion. Um, blacksmith repairs armor. Heck yeah. I want armor repair. Can you repair my armor, please? Yeah. Got my armor back. Okay, so blacksmith, good. Let's go to item shop. What do you got? You sell chocolate. Plus one intelligence, negative one dexterity. No thank you. Uh, no thank you. Wizard cloak. Hamburger. I want a hamburger. Thank you. Give me a delicious hamburger. So if you want to know a secret, that I died one day. I was trying to get a hamburger. I was I was test running this game, right? I was trying to get a hamburger. I went into a room and I died. I didn't get the hamburger, but I just got it. I just bought it. Now I have a hamburger. I'm gonna go get my fla flask. Uh, I want a flask refill so I can kill myself. Getting all my stuff back. Oh. Watch out for these little plants. They're scary. I charmed it and I got my refill. Let me kill myself. Drink this potion. Get my heart up. I have almost all my stats back. I just need to get the purple thing from my shield. Guaranteed melee weapon. Ooh, that sounds fun. All right, let's go check out the melee weapon. Oh no, it's Groot. I will disrupt your nature's peace. I will not stop you. What? <laughs> that was like the opposite that you said. There's a Mandrake. Fire is good against Mandrake. Ow. Walking into it, not good. Walking into it, bad. Am I charming it right now? What the heck? Get charmed. Oh, oh. I don't like that at all. My goodness. That's a lot of damage. Who cares about nature's peace? You made me angry. This is no personal. Yeah, yeah. Oh my goodness. I'm dead. I didn't... Now my new enemy in life is the Mandrake. The Mandrake must be defeated. That is the mission. All right. Well, we unlocked Cleric. You just have to beat the second boss to unlock Cleric. After that, I don't know anything. I haven't unlocked anything else in this. That's as far as I got for the trial run. Okay, so Mastery. What do we have? Uh, nothing over here. If I go down, I get backup armory. Floor 3 always contains an additional armory that offers two weapon choices. Oh yeah, let's take that. Oh yeah. I don't, I can't, I can't take it. I don't have enough. So we have Cleric. Cleric, a faithful cleric who wields divine magic in service of a higher power. You are revived once per floor. So, one time every floor I could revive. Oh, and you get the King Bible. So, King Bible, I, I got it one time in the test run. It's kind of like the Bible from Vampire Survivors. It's probably a reference. It also acts the same. I'm going to try Cleric. I don't know exactly what kind of build I'd go with. It looks like... She's got more stats in Intelligence and MP. She's got red strength. Yeah, I, I think it's going to be MP. Okay, so you're kind of a mage build. That's cool. Oh, nice. Look at these Bibles. Oh my gosh. Okay, get my... Magic back up. I'm gonna go with some. Oh, this is nice. The the in Vampire Survivors, the Bible's one of the most awesome weapons. At first, I was trying to avoid it because I'm like Bible, but yeah, it's pretty cool. Let's go with a key. 
Boop, 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 boop. Okay, Cleric. You're a little OP, huh? A little bit overpowered. Um, I don't know about strength. I'm gonna go with bombs. And you have that revive? Oh my gosh. And a holy heart. Oh, well, it's the heart I got. Uh, okay, so let's go with some gold. Yum, gold. Eh. All right. There's a blood chest. Sounds pretty cool. Yeah, let's go blood chest. I'll sacrifice one heart. I have a heal. Ah! I immediately lose that heart. Well, I lost, I lost my soul heart. What's going on? It seems you have been cursed. Curse can have a variety of negative effects and is basically the opposite of luck. The more stacks of curse you have, the more cursed your existence will fill. Curse also grants cursed hit chance. Cursed hits roll twice for critical hits and have to succeed the roll twice to crit. Additionally, curse can also downgrade room rewards, spawn invading reapers, Increase more prices and much more. So curse is terrible. Got it. I sacrifice my heart for calcium. Grants three stacks of dexterity growth. Wow. And zinc. I feel so healthy. I'm gonna go ahead and take those now. Okay, okay. And boom. Thank you. I'm gonna go to the event. Or what could it possibly be? I don't know, it's random. Ooh. Hi. <laughs> Welcome, Trevor. Want me to knit something for you? What's your favorite color? Uh, blue, because I'm a mage. Ah, yes. That's a nice color. I'll get right on it. That's it. Go on. Take it. It's a gift. Oh. A blue hoodie. On defeating a boss without taking damage, you are granted an additional intelligence pickup. Well, thank you. That was nice. But I kind of like my... Grants one heart recovered when revived. Uh... I'm gonna hang on to that hoodie. Arcade, try your luck. I'm gonna go to the arcade. Alright, here we go. Slot machine, just like in Binding of Isaac. I'm gonna try it again. <gasps> I got cursed. <laughs> I got double cursed. Come on. Come on, I got nothing else to spend my money on. Give me them slots. What do we got? I'm staying away in case a bomb comes out or something. <gasps> what did I get? I got an extra heart. Nice. Give me some cool stuff. I got another extra heart. I like this machine. I broke it. What happens if I bomb it? Bombing the machine. Oh, nothing. Alright, I need bombs. I'm gonna go bomb route. Boop, 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 boop. Holy Bible, Batman. I got two bombs. Guaranteed helmet, guaranteed gloves. How are we doing? We need gloves and we need helmets. I'm gonna go with the helmet. I feel like that might be a little more important. And of course, this is a spider again. What a trick. It's a 50-50 chance. Do, do, do. Only problem with the Bibles is there's a proximity thing. I do have to be within a certain range. I kind of wanted to display the other boss. But it's okay. It's okay. We'll, we'll go spider. We'll, we'll just spider this one. That's it.
Hiss, I'm going to feed you to my children. Blah. Oh, I forgot I was still playing. I actually put my controller down for a second. Well, I put, took my hands off my controller. Same thing. Okay, so if you noticed, when I heal, there's a time limit. So I can't just heal mid-battle. It takes me a minute to... It takes me a minute to... Drink my potion. Therefore, I'm not gonna do it right now. You know, makes sense, right? Yeah. Makes sense to me, makes sense to you, Papa Jen. Boss number one defeated. On to boss number two. We got Thief Hood, Brawler, Seeker Gloves. Oof. Seeker Gloves. I came here not for gloves, but I got gloves. One glove. Two glove. Me one two glove. Doing well? Yeah. How you doing, Fire? You always asking me how I'm doing. Well, I'm gonna ask you how you're doing. How's your day going, Fire? You're fired. From being fired. Mage stash. Well, I don't know if I want to change my Bibles, man. They're so cool, man. I'll check it out, though. See what you have to offer, Mage Staff. Do you have anything cooler than King Bible? Better be cooler. If it's not cooler, then you're a jeweler. It, oh, this better be King Text. I, I'll try it. I don't know what it is. Let me see. Let's see what it is. Equip. What? What the? What the heck? Okay, this does not seem practical in a fight. By the time this thing procs, the enemies are gonna be close. I'll uh, I'll pass on that one for now. All right, let's get some cake, man. I want some cake. You want some cake? You want some cake, everyone? Everyone, leave a comment below if you want cake. Just blow up the comment section about how much you love cake. What kind of cake do you like? Do you like blue cake with green whipped cream? Because that's what I'm eating. Mmm, it was delicious. Tasted like toothpaste. Yum. We have arcane shurikens. These are... This is a mana weapon. I can use this. Uh, we have Druid Bible. It's a better Bible. It's a better Bible. I like my Bible. As a secondary attack, shoots a leaf set. Oh my god, he shoots leaves. Uh, we have Razor Wand. The Shuriken sounds so cool, but so does the Bible, Druid Bible. So this is 110 to 221 slashing damage. This one. Druid Bible. Guys, Druid Bible. You know what I mean by Druid Bible? You know, you know what I'm saying? Oh my god. Oh my god, yes. I like it. I feel like Mother Nature. Except for I'm not a mother. Or a nature. Yeah, yeah, eat my butt. Oh no! You have been infected with... Poison! Poison is a statistic, you sucks. Man. Game resumes in now. I like how it gives me a time, a countdown to get back in the game. Like, hey, in case you added the element of reading, you will now resume. Give me that key. Um, so there's blacksmith for upgrades. And I kind of do want to upgrade my Bible. Yeah, let's go upgrade. What's up, bro? Um, I'll take this. Need anything forged? Yeah. 
20 gold. 20 gold. I don't have 20 gold. I want 20 gold though. I wish if you didn't have enough money, the shopkeeper would just give you some money. That'd be cool. Here we go. It's some um, intelligence. And I need more bums. I get bums. I need bums. I get. I don't know what these leaves are doing to them, but they're sticking to their face. That's pretty cool. So I have body armor already. But I'm still gonna go get. I'm gonna go see what they have to offer. Is it the lich again? I keep getting the same bosses. That's awesome. What's up, Lich? I have one revive I can use, and I'm gonna be using it fast. Oh, I got revived. So that's how the revive works. I've tried that before, and it didn't work. I might have underestimated you a little bit. Good for you. Not really, because you're about to kick my butt. I don't like this deck. Oh, man. All you see is my Bible. You can't even see me. It was just my Bible only. My Bible has surpassed me. Did we get it? Did we get another mastery? We did? So every time you beat, beat a boss, you get a ton of experience. It goes towards the pot in the middle. All right. So let's go to this backup armory. Unless something else cooler open. Money at the spot. I don't know what that means. Sounds crazy. Mm, what's up here? First aid, you start with plus one additional health flask. Oh, that sounds so cool. Sounds really cool. Weapons and armories are never enchanted with the negative enchantment. That sounds cool too. I just need, I just need to fill this whole thing up. What's easy mode? Lazy stroll. Enemies in floor one have 30% less health and armor. Enemies in floor two have 20% less health. Enemies in floor three. Wow, that does sound pretty easy. One, two, three. Call to adventure. Gain plus one suppression against that floor. One, two, and three bosses. Ooh, that's a lot of suppression. Pretty cool. How are we doing on our achievements? Uh, our unlocked achievements. So bandit class requires us to get to spend 750 gold. I mean, I've spent gold. Bard class requires us to visit a tavern 10 times. I've done one. Defeat death. Defeat death with 10 different classes. It's crazy. Gunslinger. Upgrade a cannon or gun to level 4 without the help from equipment or items. Okay. What can I... A oh, polearm spear. Have four charms equipped at the same time. Ooh, that's not actually not terribly hard. Defeat the boss. Boop, boop, boop. And progress beyond floor three. So the last like floor based unlock is floor three. I have to beat that lich to get the warrior class unlocked. Cool. Well, that is all the time I have for right now. I love this game though. I want to keep playing it. I would love to play it offline. I would love to play it on my own time. Uh, but I want to save the majority of stuff with this game for videos. So I might be pumping them out more often, just getting them kind of lined up, good to go, because this game is awesome and I want to keep playing it. Definitely, definitely recommend it. I think it's 10 bucks, 9.99, something, something like that on Steam. Definitely recommend it. Any game like this, this style, like Vampire Survivors, Binding of Isaac, you could just play this, these kind of games right here for thousands of hours and probably not really get burnt out. All right. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Oh, make sure you leave a comment below. Let me know about that favorite cake of yours. Bye-bye.